hold the two halves of the door together. the door, move this a little bit, just pull these two up here. Now you might want to watch this little door latch deal, it can be a little bit of a tricky spot here. We can beat it through a bit, there we go. And I usually just relatch the deal up here, like so. Keep that out of the way, but also you probably want to look at this piece, how it goes in together here, to make sure we can put it back the same way. Yeah, you know, should unplug the dishwasher. Work on it here. Just gotta find the plug here. Part just slides out of here. That both sides. That looks like probably the post that our spring was on. Um, usually hanging on here. I think you can probably see right here. There's our spring hanging down. It's not attached to anything, so what we have to do is find a new place to attach that spring to. And I usually can finagle and attach it to right here, this little post right here. Um, so what I do is grab it with my screwdriver or my finger or a pair of pliers. Let's see, here's my pliers. And we're going to grab the end of the spring. Thing. Anyway, here's the spring. And I'm going to have to reattach it to the end there. And Be a little tricky. Okay, I got it on that end. Now I'm take my pliers, grab it on this end, and loop it onto this tab here. Alright, now that should grab it. Now I can rotate the dial to see if the uh, arm is engaging properly, which it is. There we go. Okay, now we're going to put the two halves, well, we're going to put our cover back on here. Okay, slips underneath here, like so. There we go. And on this end, these t two tabs just go underneath there real easy. Okay, now for our half of the door, put this back together, we're going to undo this end, fold this down, and then once again we're going to position this little arm so we can pass it through the uh, other half. 
Let's just see over here. Hopefully you can see that there. Okay. And just gotta position this through. There we go. Two pads back together. Okay. Now holding it in place, I'm just gonna rotate it through. Well, first I'm gonna check and see if our soap dish latches, and it does now, before it wouldn't latch. Here we go. That's latching. It's not very tight, but that's okay. We don't need it to be too tight. It just needs to be tight enough to hold the soap dish in. And then what we're going to do is rotate our dial and uh, test and see if it pops up. And so while we're holding the uh, pieces of the deal together. See? There we go. Okay. We're good here. Everything latches properly. And so we can put our screws back in, and we're good to go. So I'm going to go ahead and grab my screws here, and put it all back together, and that's it. That's if your soap dish wasn't latching. That's how you can put the spring back together. Sometimes you may have to redo it a couple times to get it right, to get it to latch properly.